A British activist that had been shot in the head by an Israeli sniper months earlier died on January 13, 2004. In April 2003, Tom Herndl was part of a group of activists working to disrupt Israeli defense force demolitions in the Palestinian city of Rafah. Witnesses to the shooting testified that Herndal, who was just 21 at the time, had rushed to save a group of children after shots were fired nearby. After rescuing one child, he returned to help another, and during this attempt, he was shot in the back of the head. He was left in a vegetative state and died nearly nine months later in a London hospital. The IDF reluctantly started a full investigation only after international pressure began to mount, and eventually the shooter was identified as an IDF sergeant who was charged and tried, but not before first claiming that he had fired at an armed man wearing military fatigues. The award-winning marksman, who was armed with a scoped rifle, later changed his testimony, saying that he had attempted to fire a warning shot, but Herndl had moved his head at the last second. The sergeant was convicted of manslaughter and obstruction of justice and sentenced to eight years in prison, but was released after six years for good behavior.